All right, am I back? Am I back? Am I back? Am I back? Yes. Okay. Sorry about that. I think Andrea messed up a wire. Um, oh, that was on my end. Nope. It was on mine. Okay. Um, so, what the hell am I going to do here? Because Rock Slide does not kill. I could go for the Rock Slide flinch and just bank. But, you know, I'm risking Tummy's freaking life here. Right? Are you sack jaws? Yeah. I basically need to, huh? I guess the benefit of that is that I can send out Stinger after that. Do I really want to sack stuff right now, though? I need all the encounters I can get. But do I even have a choice? I cannot risk Tummy. I'd rather sack Jaws than risk Tummy, let's be real. You don't have a chance later you gotta risk though. It's either him or Hippo, and Hippo is your only ground type. Yeah, I don't think Jaws is needed to be fair. Fudge. Alright, fine. All right, whatever. Fell Stinger away. Okay. Ain't no way we don't just one-shot this thing to the next side, Bolivian. Run my fade. Okay. For a steel type next encounter, then sweep begins. Yeah. Fly. Thank you. It's actually so useful. Fly, let's go. Okay, but I didn't get the Surf TM, what the freak. Are they making a GD level? What's that? I just realized that I dropped for Alligator. Why did I do that? <laughs> Why did I drop for Alligator? What was the purpose? Just because he sucks? I guess so. Still good to have a water type, though. We got a fire, water, grass core now, so that's good. All starters, by the way. No day's crazy. Okay. So. What now? Oh, new encounter. Nice. Battle arena is closed. Balls. Okay, I can surf. Oh, we're banking on new encounter here. Please, something insane. Do I have a... Can Feral learn first false swipe? I'm not going to worry about it. Whether I'm happy or upset about this. Trash. <laughs> Can't even use Last Respects. Do you think Last Respects works in this game? Because we're in a Nuzlocke mode. Res your box. Um. Okay, hear me out, chat. If Revival Blessing actually works, I think it should be allowed, right? Because, like... Think about it, right? We're in a Nuzlocke mode. If it really revives my dead Mon, I think it should be allowed, no? I can't revive Scissor. I don't want to hear from this thing. Oh. Oh. Never mind. I see, I see what y'all are saying. You could technically go into a double battle, or uh, any battle, and just revive a Mon that's dead in our party. Okay, I didn't mean it like that. 
Nah, it's a little too cheese, if that actually worked. I just meant, like, in a current battle. Like, if something died in that battle, then you could Revival Blessing it. <gasps> oh, what happened? No, that's BS. That's BS. Look, I tell you what I'm gonna do. The game glitched. I didn't even... No, I'm not counting that. I'm just gonna encounter it again and catch one. Call me a cheater, I don't give a damn. I don't know what the hell happened. For some reason I clicked fight and I don't know. This is different from the Magmar though. The Magmar one, I just got unlucky. And I kind of misplayed a little bit. Alright, it's not even like it's that cra crazy of an encounter. I guess it's fast and strong, right? What body part is palmy? This is another mod that I've literally never used. Pause? I mean, that's pretty fair, to be fair. <laughs> it's literally pause. <clears throat> Alright. Oh, shoot! Uh-oh. I might be in trouble. <clears throat> Please don't murder my ass. Got rid of your rain. You know what? I'm just gonna EQ his ass. He did say the thing. Hold on. I kinda wanna see what that item is. Should be a TM, right? Replacing rain, all a part of your plan. Yes, sir. Oh my god, this is the best day. I guess I could check out the tower, but I'm worried. Oh, it's currently closed. Never mind. Well, I'm stuck. Um, can I fly anywhere for it to be useful? Like, can I get any additional encounters? I don't think so. You know what? No, I do have a theoretical encounter, right? There's a static Lapras. But then again, what if... Plus, that technically is Pinwheel Claws, that one extra... Yeah. Alright, I might do that. I'm gonna Pinwheel Claws and hopefully this... I'm worried the Static Lapras will be a totem battle, though. Because it really might. But then again, I also might get a good reward out of it. Oh, another idea. Hold on, I can surf now. Can't I, like, go over here? Well, this is a new route, right? Route 27. Sure. The sun is running up. Weasel. This is the definition of mediocre. Just getting some encounters. What body part is Buizel? Tail? I feel like this is pretty safe for tail, right? Tails. Arms. I don't think arms really is fitting at all for this. What's down here? Nothing. Good. All right, Tojo Falls, what do we got? Something good, please. I'm banking. I'm banking. Can 
Did you have any encounter stuff here? Oh, I guess not. I guess we could surf. Wait, it technician in this game? Okay, that's actually kind of goaded, right? You can run Aqua Jet. Okay, hold on. I actually see the argument. Honestly, I might use Full Silver for Alligator then. For Alligator kind of sucks right now. I mean, yeah, I get that he's Tough Claws, but like... Ain't no with it. way! There's no encounters in here. Can I fish? No, give me something, please. All red, red changes, basically, or just some? I think I use most of them. If he gets... If so, he gets surging strikes. No way! Okay, if he gets that, that's an instant take, for sure. Please! Give me something! I don't think there's any encounters here, chat. This is so sad. Oh, we got Weasel, I guess. Alright, any other encounters that we could find? Um... We already got Ruins of Elf. I think I gotta do the Pinwheel Claws for Union Cave. It's really all I can think of. For rats that we've missed. We've done Dark Cave. We've gone up here. Alright. Who knows, maybe we'll be able to find some items that are good too. Oh! There might also be Pinwheel down here. Hold on. Never actually thought about this. Heracronite. Because I know this place does go down. We can check the deck snap to see if the encounters are different. <gasps> what about in here? Oh my god. What is this? Union Cave. Oh, this is a shortcut? Interesting. I mean, I've been here before though, right? Nugget. That's actually really interesting that it connects. Laprasite. Well, hey, if we could actually catch the Lapras, that'd be insane. Okay, so this is like going down Union Cave. Whoa, okay. Spectral Shriek. I'm finding all types of stuff. Hold on. Nobody can learn it. All these moves, that, <laughs> these custom moves. I don't know if this is going to give me anything. I mean, it's not going to give me a new encounter, so whatever. I'm not going to worry about it. Getter is bulkier, which you kind of need in your team right now. Honestly, you're not wrong. My team is actually... It's so funny. My team used to be nothing but bulk, and now it's, like, kind of becoming a little too frail. I don't know. Maybe I do got to get a uh, slow volt switch back on tummy. It's complicated. Slow volt switch would be so useful for feet and stinger, man. Weasel could also learn flip turn. I just wish Booty Cheeks could learn flip turn, man. I don't know what this will do, but I'm not really interested right now. Well, we did want to check the bottom of Union Cave, so let's just get this done really quick. Alright, so we gotta remember what encounters uh, are here. Okay, so if the encounters are different on the lower uh, end, then it counts as pinwheel claws. Oh no, there is no lower end! What? They got rid of the lower end for Union Cave, or am I tripping? Oh no, is it down here? Oh, it's down here. Never mind, I'm tripping. Oh! Okay, I guess there's no pinwheel claws then, but. Um. This is a static encounter. I am very worried this is going to be a totem battle, though. Ugh, 
I'm really worried there's gonna be a totem battle, man. Because if it is, I'm just screwed. I guess lead stinger. Toxic and protect Meganium. Steel Dragon, I could get one. Oh, damn. Mega Steelix. Silence's favorite Mon. Nah, Silence made a Mega Steelix, bro. Booty Cheeks at least resists both of its stabs, unless it has Freeze Dry, which it definitely could. <laughs> Hodge. You can't catch totems, you just kill them. I don't know if this is a totem, though, is my thing. I literally have no idea. Please don't be a totem. Yes! Okay, it's just an encounter. Alright, this is static! This is valid. Um, I'm just gonna base U-turn. Alright. Got some damage. Um, I'm a little bit worried about freeze dry. This thing kind of covers my entire team. <laughs> if it has freeze dry. Rain dance. Let's be real. If booty cheeks goes down, I'm not even gonna care. He has water absorbed. I just got dicked. Please, booty cheeks. Now I have infinite citrus berries, at least. Please don't crit. Please don't crit. Okay, we're good. We're not fishing. Alright, let's just go for it. Yes! Lapras gets Technician, Mega Lapras gets Slush Rush. Do we not have a Laprasite already? Mega Lapras has a BST of 635. Insane. All right, what body part is Lapras? Is this like the perfect shell? Like, we don't have a shell, right? You do have one. Oh shoot, okay. I could actually see the argument of getting rid of Mega Beedrill for this just because it'll give me a bulky Mon, right? Shell or neck, we already have neck. Flip, okay, I kind of love flippers though. I'm gonna do flippers. Shout out to flippers, bro. Cause there's other shell mons. There aren't that many flipper mons. That's my man flippers. I assume that Mega Lapras is very bulky, right? Is that a fair assumption? Oh, there's a Mega Stone over here. Machampite. Hey, if that is Radical Red, uh, Mega Machamp, that crap is insane. All right, let's see if there's a Pinwheel Claws Mon in here. All right. Colossalite. Colossite. We have strength. We actually just got that. Silver Knight. I guess that makes sense, to be fair. All right, so no new encounters in here, but we got some mega stones at least. Okay. Um, are there any static encounters in here that I could surf to? Probably not. I would imagine. Listen, I know I'm grasping at straws. I just, <laughs> I need encounters, man. Fudge. Did I ever get the egg? Yeah, I did. Sorry, Lapras is adaptability, not technician. Water absorb probs still better for Mega Lap. Hmm. Alright, let's check it out. Uh, I do have a um, Laprasite, right? Yes, I do! So that's an option. 
The thing is that Mega Beedrill is very strong. Giving me a Mystic Water too, I'll take it. Let's be real, even Base Lapras is way better than Feralgator right now though. I get that he has Tough Claws, but bro, his moveset's not there. He doesn't have much going for him. He's just, he's just, you know. He does damage, but he doesn't take hits that well, and he's not fast, and like, I don't know. I feel like he kind of needs Dragon Dance if he's really gonna come in clutch. Water Absorb. Give me your Spadef Tank. Yeah. Even non Mega Lap. And this thing gets Shell Armor, does it not? Yes, it does. Probably just run Adaptability, though, huh? It's Adaptability. Like, how could you not? It's freaking Adaptability. <laughs> Water Absorb is good for pivoting, but like, I don't know. Alright, Mega Lap, 130 HP, 85 attack, 90 defense, 145 spatak, 105 spadef. Hmm, 80 speed. Hard choice. Three very good abilities there. Yeah, for sure. I think I'm gonna stick with adaptability. Because, I mean, with his stats, he will be able to hit hard. You said it gets slush rush once it mega evolves? Let me check it out against a wild mon really quick. The problem is that that doesn't really help me when it megas, because I don't have a hail team. Slash rush. Uh, unless you give hail on its set, which I don't really want to do. Yeah, I think probably Mega B Drill is the keep. Obviously, this mon is very bulky, though. I bet that regular Lapras hits harder anyway, though, with adaptability. It'd be close. And we can hold an item. And that's really Ice Shard is nice too. True. Ain't no way Lap Lapras gets flip turn, huh? If this thing gets flip turn, it's an instant stay. All the time. But I, I really don't think it'll get it. I really truthfully do not think it'll get it. Nah. God, that would've been so good. I still think I'll use this, though. Adaptability lap. I also really agree with Shell Armor. But, man. This thing's just gonna be strong. Like, flat out. It's a strong mod. So, you have options there. It's mixed. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and it, honestly, this does make a pretty decent spadef wall. 130 HP, 95 spadef. Maybe I do min speed. It doesn't get a pass move, though, unfortunately. Life do. I guess that could be really good for doubles, huh? Ice shard. Teach that over rain dance. Hydro Pulse. Let's run Water Gun. I think that's a great idea. I guess I just keep Brine. Or I could run Pump. Ugh, I'll just run Pump. Probably not worth, I would imagine. Uh. I guess I'll keep the attack minus nature. Ah, 
<laughs> no, actually, it's mixed. Like, there's no reason to do that. Especially... Yeah, let's do minus speed. I feel like that makes the most sense. Minus speed raise spadef. I think. We still need that spadef tank, yeah. Oh, I picked the opposite one. Minus speed up spadef. That's fine. And again, it'll hit pretty hard with its ice shards because of its mixed attacks. Yeah, honestly, I kind of like this. Adaptability, ice shard with 115 attack. Like, it's really not that weak, especially when you factor in adaptability. Like, it's getting a lot out of that. Oh yeah, Rintoid says they'll do minus speed personally if TM says to learn. Um, let's find out. Uh, we probably just want to do focus on water and ice. I thought this one freeze dry. Hmm. I don't really know what I would teach. I guess protect, just to have. I see the argument for body slam too, but that's really just for the para. I think I'd rather just have body slam. If only I had Surf. I teach Surf in a heartbeat over Hydro. I guess I grew to Body Slam. Toxic could be nice. Yeah, but with adaptability, like, you gotta understand, this one's actually gonna hit really hard. I don't even think we need Toxic. Like, I think this thing just kills things. With adaptability, its attack stats are basically, like, 160. Which is higher than Cinderace. Like, it's definitely hitting hard. It benefits more from Adapt. For sure. For sure. For sure. God, if this thing got freeze dry, it'd be over, man. I think this is a good encounter, though. I really do. Even base. We'll go to the Laprosite. Um give you do bulldoze for doubles to help tummy Ooh, that's valid i do like protect for blind but honestly you're kind of cooking with that one and you know what else i've realized this is the shell bell mon we're doing damage we're slower than the opponent which is important for shell bell we're slower right so we can click slow ice beam do all the damage with adaptability or we could even have the choice to click ice shard to heal to live the next hit potentially this is the shell bomb on faux show i like that i can actually see the argument for doing an offensive nature but honestly i'll just take the hits it's fine I kind of like Bulldoze, though. I kind of agree with that. Help Tommy out. Speed control is always nice anyway. That's better on Hippo over Bulldoze uh, to get Yawns off safely. Honestly, you're probably right. I haven't clicked Bulldoze yet. For being realistic. You know what I would put over Shell on Heartbeat though? Assault Vest. Bro, this thing with AV would be insane. Ugh. God, it'd be so good. I think you're right though. I think we're gonna do uh, Protect. Plus it also has the benefit of being able to stall out sand turns. Like, do some sand chip to the opponent. All right, I like that. That was actually a good, uh, that was a good call. Going to get that Lapras.
Um. All right, we already went to National Park. There's no other routes that we can go to get encounters. Yeah, I think we're just kind of stuck. Unless, wait, maybe there's bonus stuff. No, but there's an item here. I just, I just left this here, Are you for real? Is you for real? Tepig's chilling over here. Well, never mind. This might be the strongest I've seen. What? I, I don't think so. My team earlier in game was insane. Golisopod? Ah, oh, I had everything, man. I'm really tempted to try slow volt switch on this thing, but I also really like this thing's speed. No, I want this thing to be fast. This thing being somewhat fast is like so good. Like if you outspeed get rock slide flinches, it's over. Granted, I know it's not that fast, but it outspeeds like min speed mods. Yo, Lissapod was insane, man. I need a slow flip turner or a slow volt switcher or something. All right, we're leading Stinger. Uh, get me out of here. I also want to see if I miss Surf over here because I really want Surf on uh on Lapras if I can. Like, there's no way. It gave me the TMs for all the other moves. Why would you not give it to me now? It says Lapras gets Baton Pass, but I don't know how it gets it. Rentoid, please find out how. Is it level up? It's probably an egg move. No. Yeah, it doesn't get it here. No, I want Baton Pass so bad. That'd be insane. It's probably an egg move, though, I would bet. All right. Let's get out of here. Freeze Dry is an egg move. Just a heads up. Fudge! God damn it. Maybe there's an egg move tutor. Currently closed. All right, let's move on. Route 40. My question is, do we want to try to get rid of the rain with a pout on every battle or... Cause we can. That would probably help a lot against these trainers. Yeah, I actually think that's better than Stinger. Because I'm not going to be able to switch in and pout on on uh, water types is the problem. I think you need to lead. Yeah, because this would have been Swift Swim. Yeah, this is definitely the play. Then Femur. Jet Punch. Yo, that's crazy. I guess you know what I should do? I should check out uh, Float Soul, right? Because I can also dig into the rain, but I don't know. I think getting rid of the rain is the play. Because it, it makes a lot of these mons so much less useful. Woo! That's fine. Should have draining kissed. I threw. I just replace it. I would imagine this thing can't one-shot me. What? It's fine. Wasn't even scared. <gasps> oh no, the... Oh no! Okay, wait, 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 wait. If I drain and kiss, Ficious Rend will be weaker. Uh, I think I need to. Anti-synergy with sand. That's true. 
I think I still drain in case. I'm worried that he'll be banded. But I think I just... I, I think I, I think I just do it. Okay, yeah, yeah, we're good, we're good, we're good. Woo! Okay, we're good. Yeah, femur's good, man. Good, good encounter. That's my goat. <laughs> Bro, why'd the music stop? It's so... Like, what's going on? Surf! Oh my god, yes! Get rid of Hydro right now. I don't care. I'm not missing. Or can I get rid of Bulldoze? I'll have two options for moves in that case. The problem is with Surf is that Surf is actively not good in double battles. Because I'm hitting my partner. I'll get rid of Bulldoze. I know it's good for Tummy, but like... I can't imagine myself ever clicking Bulldoze instead of just going for a kill on something anyway. Even in a double battle. Need Hydro for doubles, yeah. Because, again, Lapras is kind of deceiving. Like, with adaptability, this thing hits really freaking hard. Alright. That's scary, though. The rain just comes right back after it runs out. I didn't think it would do that. I'd rather run Screen than Hydro TBH. You mean, um, like Light Screen? I don't even know if I get that. Smooth Rock? I don't have that. Yeah, I don't get screens on, a. Uh, on lap. Yeah. Primarina, get rid of the rain. Oh, you're gonna be throat spray, huh? That's fine. I can't imagine the world where Primarina can beat Femur in a 1v1. Oh, we're fine. I thought you were going to be Liquid Voice Throat Spray. This thing sucks ass. Why are you running Bubble Beam? So far, we're kind of running up. We got our first double battle coming up, though. Overquill. Swift Swim Overquill, likely. Yeah, he's not in Tim. Honestly, let's just stay in and click EQ. No way this thing can one-shot me. He's not rain boosted. Water's not stab. It's fine. Yeah, we're fine. Take that. Um. Water type move incoming. Low-key tempted for Tummy, but I don't know. I know I have the spit F buff. I'm, I still just don't want to take a water type move. Could make the argument... I think flippers. And just... Ugh, no, it's a spit F tank, man. I can protect to see what he does, but I don't want to waste sand turns. I want Sand to be up as long as possible. Stinger's just way too hard to switch in. I guess Femur. It's kind of weird though, no? I think slowly take it out with Flippers. Scald. We're fine. He's Lord. Wow. Alright. It could be, um... Burn. Shell Bell? Yikes. Okay, maybe Citrus is better. <laughs> maybe Citrus is better. <gasps> Hurricane! What the fudge? Come from! 
Damn! Did... Did sand run out? Fudge! Damn it! Oh, I'm so aggravated. Damn it! I don't want to risk Felstinger not killing. Fudge! Helioptile. Ain't no way you outspeed me. I'm so mad. Holy crap. Just kill it. Yeah. Bro. What just happened? What just happened? <sighs> Let's check out Buizel. Ah, oh, that was such a good encounter, man. Look at this death box. There's so much power in here. Do I get Surging Strikes? Let me get Surging Strikes, Technician. Technician. We could run Swift Swim Tails in the rain right now. I don't know how useful that would be though against all these other rain related mons. I'm sure he gets Flip Turn at least. But again, there's another Frail Mon. Is this even useful for me to have? God is a fast mod though, holy crap. Even at Adamant, his speed is just so high. In Technician, I think, yeah. I mean, this is Technician flip turn, right? Um, Aqua Jet as well, may as well. Technician boosted. Stab boosted. Aqua Tail, damn. Why has for Alligator not learned Aqua Tail yet? Flip turn is very nice, damn. Technician flip turn, man. 60 base power. Fudge, that's so good. When I really think about it, that's insane. 90 base power, and you switch out. This is a flip turn goat. Technically, we could lead technician flip turn in the rain just to do extra damage, but again, there's gonna be a lot of water types. I don't even think it's worth it. Power up punches technician. Eh. I'd rather run power up punch. Honestly, with this fast of a mon, I could see power up punch being really good here. This is a way to set up, right? Could be good on a revenge kill. Don't forget to heal, yeah. Ooh, Rock Tomb. That'd be really good, actually. Yeah, Technician boosted again. 90 base power. Can I learn Aerial Ace? No. I guess just teach it Ice Punch just to have. Well, I don't know. My, my set is too perfect, as is. <laughs> Unless I'd rather have Ice Punch over Power Up Punch. Um, The problem I see about Power Up Punch is that this is basically a flip turn machine, this mod. I think I'd rather just have Ice Punch. Uh, 
All right. This is actually a pretty, this is a pretty insane mod. I'm not gonna lie. 150 base power. He's strong too. What? I guess just because I'm adamant. Wow. This is definitely the Mystic Water Holder. I can't even believe that I just got Hurricane O code. That is insane. That is truly insane. Could check out the Palmot thing. I already have a water type. Yeah, hold on. It picked Scald five times in a random hurricane. How the fuck are you meant to know? I know! Like, god damn it. I thought it was like a stall meant like set, you know? That crap is insane. I just can't even believe that happened. I told it to go hurricane. That crap is insane. On switching, randomly went hurricane, bro. What the fuck? Palmo, hold on, it's gotta grow its hair. Arm thrust, trash. I think a technician. Can't evolve. Why not? How do you evolve this thing? Is it friendship? I assume they are to friendship evolutions. Thunderstone? Oh, is it really? Girl! Come off as really lion. No, I made it up. Gets Iron Fist. Nuzzle's really good to have, though, I will say. I love Nuzzle. How do I evolve this thing in this game? I'm walking 1,000 steps with it? Okay, so how do I do that here? Do I literally walk 1,000 steps in-game? Hold on, I'm walking. Hold on, we walking, boys. We walking, boys. Looked it up, Lamel. Beep, 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 dee, dee, dee. All right, we walking, boys. We walking, boys. We walking, boys. Yes, sir. We stay walking. We stay walking. All right, that's definitely gotta be enough, right? Fudge. Maybe it's in docks. Yeah, I cannot find it. Wow, well, I gotta know how to evolve this thing. Otherwise, it's just a useless encounter.
I mean, my next assumption is friendship, but like... How would they even do that? I'm so confused. Well, I can't use it if I can't evolve it. I guess I'm messing with Floatzel. At least there'll be a water resist. An additional water resist, I should say. God, this mod is so frail, though. It's even frailer than Cinderace. I still think I have to lead Snout, get rid of the, uh, the what's it called. I don't have Meganium to switch into now, though. But I can't deal with Swift Swimmers. Not with Beedrill. I get the feeling I'm gonna die on this route. Something's telling me. I don't have a good water resist. I guess I could... I mean, I have flippers, but... Water Absorb might be a play. Yeah. I think I have to. I think you're right. Water absorb for this route. So that I can switch in for free. And then use toxic for now. That's fine. We have a double battle we're about to deal with, though, is my issue. I guess lead Tummy and uh, Snout, why not? That's the set. I guess it would have saved a certain Mantine, you're right. Whole last Zarud. All right, let me see this devil battle. Pasho Berry might be clutch too. You know what? You're right. For this route, definitely run Pasho Berry. Rentoy got all the smart ideas. Hold on. All right. Hell, I'm kind of tempted to run out of snout too. I'm gonna do it. Call me crazy. Interesting. I mean, we're dual Pasho buried. So, like, I may as well just EQ for free. And then Rock Slide, right? Why not? Yeah, it was pretty free. That did a good amount of damage. Pasho berry. Shalite work, we heal. Oh my god! The perfect combo! That was good, wow. We could run Pasho Berry on feet for now. But I don't know. I don't need that many water resists. Because we have... Yeah, like, we have water resists. We could always pivot from something else. New route! Insane. Okay, new encounter. Um, Just go for it. We need it right now. Alright, give me something insane, bro. Please. Insane! Oh my god. 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 What do I do? What do I even do? Okay, I need to damage it. Okay, 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 it's fine, it's fine. Uh, I want to sleep it, but we gotta damage it a little bit first. So Ice Beam it. Screech. 
This is fine. We have the shell bell. Just, just play it slow. God damn! Okay, S slow your roll, please. He has attack up. I'm actually a little worried about Fury Cutter. He's gonna start doing a lot of damage. I can't even miss. This thing can like sweep me. Oh, well, I guess if I put it to sleep, then he stops, right? So I could yawn. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Protect. Of course, of course. Protect. 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 You're right. Just protect straight up. Okay, he's not spamming anyway. It's wild AI. Um. Okay, definitely still yawn. He missed. I do want to damage him like one more time. And Ice Beam's kind of the wave. Ice Punch works. We can do that. Okay. I think I'm going to play it safe. I really don't want to risk crit against this thing. So we're going to send back out Snout. Quick attack, we're fine. Yawn. Protect. Oh my god. Please. I can't do this. Assault is that defense drops, yeah. I think I gotta risk another ice punch. I think I just gotta do it. I just gotta do it. Ah! Okay, we're good. The game doesn't let you heal even in wilds. Honestly, I'm worried this thing's... Okay, well, if we can just keep putting it to sleep. We gotta put it to sleep no matter what. Thankfully, since he's steel, he does, he can't be killed by what's it called. I think I protect just in case. That way he can't uh, Fury Cutter twice. Yawn. Switch. I don't call it Fury Cutter. I think Feet's actually really free here. Nice miss. Okay. Come on! Please! Oh my god. Please! Until he screeches me, I'm just gonna keep spamming ultras. God, I'm gonna cry. I don't have a way to heal! Fudge! I hate catching legendaries, bro. I hate catching legendaries, bro. No! I gotta take every sleep turn I can, bro. See you, Grease. Come on! He's still asleep. Okay. I gotta yawn. 
Screech. Uh, I'm gonna take some damage, but I gotta get the Yawn off. This is the worst. I hate this. I'm gonna cry. You have Chesto? No, I have Pasho, Rantoid. I have Pasho. Granted, Rest is still definitely the play. That's my only way of healing. I had to reset the drop. Honestly, I think I switch right now and Rest while I can. Which, I think that's fine. Wow. Okay. Uh, instant wake up. Love to see it. But yeah, Rest is safe. Rest is safe. Um... I do have to wake up, though. He holds. I may as well chuck one Ultra Ball. I don't know if turns count, though. Like, do I have to click an attack in order for one of the sleep turns to count? He does hold. I'm gonna run out of yawns. You have to attack? That sucks ass. Fudge. I think I just slow rest. Thankfully, I think he's actually out of screeches, which is a good thing because, um, it's too much. Come on, man. <laughs> Please don't do this. He's not that move has like a million PP. No, I think Screech is unique. It doesn't even have that much. Alright, well, I'm wrong. I'm gonna reset the counter if I switch. I wish I had a way to lower his attack stat. But I just don't. This really stinks, man. Damn. That much? What's the world where Fell Singer from a non-Mega B drill doesn't kill? It's a quad resist, right? Or does Buggy even resist itself? I don't even know. Ah, uh, man. I mean, he's at the health. I just have to get lucky. Which I am not. Should I attempt to wake up while he's asleep? I just want to chuck balls, man. I need to take every chance that I can get. Come on! Please! I hate everything. I'm cringing. Please. Come on. Oh my god. Are you serious? Are you serious?! Fudge! Ah. Uh... He clicked Fury Cutter randomly three times in a row. Are you serious? That's a random move and he just saw him to click it three times in a row. 
My my unluckiness is unparalleled. I think at this point in the run, it sucks because you straight me this exactly. I think at this point in the run, especially now that I've lost Snout, I would sack everything on my team just to get this Genesect. She doesn't get it. You're right, Dolphin. She doesn't get it. This is serious business. <laughs> I mean, there's nothing I can do. I guess I could Mega just to get the extra stats. I don't know how useful that's gonna be. Like, I can Mega Poison Jab. Does Beedrill even get defense? Next ball catches trust. I don't know if Beedrill gains defense by Mega Evolving. It might not. I'm so bummed. I just can't even believe that that happened. He got Fury Swipes on random move three times in a row. It does not change. Okay, I might as well just chuck balls then. This is ridiculous. Yes! Yes! Oh my god. Oh my god. Ah. Oh my god. Okay, that might have been worth. Genesect for Avaldon? That's a pretty good trade. What did I miss? You missed a lot. We just went through an anime arc trying to catch this Genesect. We lost a Powdown in the process, though. Because he got- he picked Fury Swipes. No, he clicked- oh my God. He kicked Fury Cutter three times in a row on a random move. I got a 1 in 4 chance three times in a row. This really is the bug run. True, I've gotten like every bug type. I aged 40 years in that fight alone. Bro. Listen, I hate catching legendaries, but I will say it makes these legendary catches way more hype. I can't believe we actually got it. I was about to, I was ready to sack everything just to catch this thing. I really was. All right. What body part is Genesect? Cannon. <laughs> Everyone's favorite body part, Cannon. This thing is like stupid broken too. It is. It's a good ass mon. Grin. What the heck is... Grin is not a body part. <laughs> oh my god. We had to get rid of our sand setter though. Skeleton? Okay, skeleton actually is kind of goaded. Exoskeleton also works. I'll just do skeleton. I actually think that's so fitting. This is skeleton, bro. Our inners. He, he deserves to be the full skeleton. That is true. For murdering one of my mons. One of my most important mons, too. Hot damn. I cannot believe he got Fury Cutter off random move three times in a row. My unluckiness is unparalleled, bro. I think I gotta go back, uh, Pokemon Center. Alright, well, Snout, you have served us well in that water route. But I think we are still in a water route. God, you know what that means? That means we have to do the rest of this water route without something to change the weather.
That's really bad. I think we just go all in on Tails in that case. Or maybe even Stinger. I'm worried about Swift Swim, but I think that's our play. What were the other encounters? There was some heat in here, but yeah, Genesex is definitely the best one. Congrats, you now have a Steel type with a top five type combo and stupid coverage. That's true. Now what I will say though about it is that in blind, Genesect might not be as crazy as you might think. Granted, we definitely give it fire type berry every day of the week. <sighs> Patch protect lappers with free water absorb pivots. Yeah, I might need to. <sighs> yeah, let's just do it. It'll be safer, I know it will. Alright, we're gonna use Stinger though. Shame I don't have a T Bolt TM. Do I not? I have Flamethrower. Do I really not T Bolt? That's odd. But hey, teach a Flamethrower. Give Genesis a move said No, I did not. Doing it right now. Hey, let's change its ability. <laughs> Great thing about this too is that, um, honestly, I would not be against, um, I would honestly debate a neutral nature for this thing. I really would. That way it could make use of both downloads. I don't think this thing gets U-turn, huh? t what isn't a TM in this game, apparently. Why? Now that's odd. That's very odd. Can this thing just get like Volt Switch, please? It gets U-turn at Stab. Definitely take that. Fly... Is Fly buffed? It is. It's aight! If I had uh, lefties, I'd do it in a heartbeat. May as well give it a quick attack, though. I wonder how AI works with Fly. Like, do they switch out? Who gets Giga Drain? Interesting. Um, probably not run Metal Claw. Gets Electro Web. Eh. Teach Flash Cannon? Do I have Flash Cannon? Yes, Spectral Shriek. I want to see what this is, though. What? That's awesome! Let's lose a Haunted Cry with a power to inflict damage. Damn! That's a good-ass move. 95 base power. It's just better Shadow Ball. Damn. I'll get rid of Fly for that. You don't need Flamethrower on this route. Good point. Gotta be efficient. Um, don't need access. I already have U-turn. Dark Pulse is kind of tempting, but Dark Pulse is um, weaker than Spectral Shriek, right? We could just teach Electro Web for this route. We already have Giga Drain. I kind of like its move set though. It'll be nice to have a Ghost type move. You never know what might show up. Yeah, I think this move set works actually. I guess I'll keep the neutral nature. Yeah, what's cool about this moveset is that he is mostly special. You know what though? No. Run modest. I think run modest. Because like if we get the attack up, U-turn is going to be better anyway. 
And we want to do more damage with our special attacks when we can. Yeah, never mind. I actually think that makes more sense. My hand hurts from slamming my desk too hard. One thirty speed as well. All of a sudden, our team is very fast. <laughs> Manti and Gyarados, which are most likely on this route. Yeah. Loki tempted to run Floatzel over. <sighs> yeah, I think Floatzel. Well, no, because I want to get the Mega Evolution right off the bat. Heartbroken, hippo broken, hand broken, <laughs> all broken. All right, let's just do it. Oh, shoot, I guess I should have taught Electro Web, but we already fought Mantine. Delmise. Um, I mean, this should just die to poison, right? Swift Swim out speeds, Baildrop, by the way. Yeah, I know. But this does not have Swift Swim. Wait. I always get confused by Delmise typing. It's Grass Ghost? So no, Ghost resists poison, so you turn out. Sonic to poison, yeah. Uh, you're probably gonna click a ghost type or steel type move. We can spectral shriek. Spatak, he clicks knock. Um, that's fine. Catch the spectral shriek. Okay. Nice and slow. So as long as we're not getting swift swimmed, okay. Fudge, I don't have hippo and tummy to run anymore. That was such a good combo, man. Fudge. How about stinger and tails? Just double U-turn, flip turn to handle any lead. Kind of missed the auto heal. What do you mean by the auto heal? I think this is fine. I still want to run Technician over Swift Swim. Um, Scenario is to bait Water Move and swap Lapras into that slot. That's also valid. That is valid. Because when else am I going to use feet? But I don't know. I'm going to do so much more damage. No, I'm going to stick with this. I believe in this strat because I need to Mega and I also really want to make use of the rain power for flip turn. Hmm. Okay. Well, you have dry skin. So I kind of just got dicked. Let's try to take out Toxic Croak. Um, I can't though, because you're going to be dry skin. I guess try to take out Empoleon in that case. U turn, flip turn. That did some good ass damage though, hot damn. Alright, uh. Uh, they can really click anything on Tails here. Not a steel type move, not a water type move, but they click a poison or fighting type move. So I guess skeleton is pretty valid here. Yeah. Attack, sludge wave. Hey, that was good! Damn, that outspent me though. I forgot to mega? What the fudge? Did I really not click the mega button? What is wrong with me? Uh, Skeleton Switch on Sludge Wave is really good, though. Um. Could just send in Feet. I don't think that helps me, though. 
Honestly? I'll send back in Tails. Tails did so much damage with Flip Turn just now. To a resisted Empoleon. Like that combined with a skeleton move, that'll just kill. Yeah, sure. Surf, and yeah, we resist! Wow! Okay, definitely gotta get Genesect out. Um, I'm not risking Genesect. I like the idea of switching on Surf. I'm assuming they do not click Sledge Wave because they see Skeleton is here. I'm gonna hard swap because I have, I might not have speed. Yeah, I'm gonna switch to Flippers baiting water. Nice! Oh, rain boosted flip turn is actually so good. My CC Genesec though. Ooh. No, because you're right. I might be able to live one. <laughs> I might be able to live one. Let's just bank. Uh, you're not really clicking water type moves. I could just send in feet. And just click acrobatics, yeah. We're good. We are all good. Acrobatics into... Uh, it could be on just in case. Nice. Oh, man. Might be choice. Oh, maybe it was. Well played, well played. Yeah, honestly, hey, I was... I don't mean to toot my own horn, but... The Floatzel lead was kind of goaded. Two flip turns, two shot, uh, Empoleon. That was insane. Okay. Honestly, after seeing that performance, I might lead Tails instead of Beedrill. That was so much damage. That's Technician boosted, Stab boosted, Rain boosted. Granted, we're not Swift Swim, so we may not outspeed everything, but I don't know, man. And they cannot click a water type move. So we could, like, then pivot into a feat, theoretically. Which could not be bad. I don't know. It's really relevant since you don't get defense from it. You're not wrong. Um, you know what? I think... I'd actually rather have Feraligator over Beedrill, then. If Feraligator dies, he dies. I'd actually rather have something I'm okay with sacking. I do not want to sack Beedrill. If I'm not leading Mega Beedrill, Mega Beedrill's not even that useful. Let's be real. Cinderace isn't really either. I'd be okay with getting rid of that. Um... I mean, for singles, he's okay. Yeah, I'll keep Cinderace, I guess. Maybe in the next double battle, though, I'll get rid of Cinderace. Okay. Oh my god. Caracosta. This is fine. Flip turn. God damn! <laughs> that damage! <laughs> Uh, probably just a rock type move, I would imagine. Send in Tummy. Although you're probably Swift Swim. But I mean, what can he do to Tummy? Like, nothing? Shell Smash? Oh. Feral? No, you're not wrong. Oh, he still has Salt Rocks. Okay, that's fine. I'm okay with that. Nice. Cryo moves. I mean, we have Aqua Jet on, uh, what's it called? Crisis Averted, yeah. I mean, I guess I'm risking, what, Hurricane here? I mean... Gator's nature, that didn't look right. 
What the fudge? Why is he defense lowering? I mean, we have Pasho Berry. We could switch on the Hurricane, quad resist, then eat whatever water type move he has with Pasho Berry. Pelipper's not that strong. Even in the rain, I think we'll be fine. It's actually a pretty valid strat, I think. No way he clicks a water type move, though. Hurricane, quad resist. I'm not gonna risk it off of Confusion, though. Confusion proc into rain boosted water move will probably still do a lot of damage. In fact, he always clicks water type move, so Flippers is a free switch. Nice. Um, honestly, I'll talk to protect this. Fudge! Oh, that's so bad. I think I have to... Uh, Stealth Rocks makes this complicated. I guess just hard swap Tummy again. Yeah, Tummy into the Hurricane. Because he never clicks Scald here. He knows I have Water Absorb. This is actually pretty free. Hurricane... I didn't get confused, but I don't want to risk Scald at this point. My HP is too low. I know I have the berry, but... Alright, so Water Absorb. What? Why did... Wait, what? What, what just happened? <laughs> what just happened? Okay. Uh... Okay. Think you had speed? You know, the crazy thing is that you're probably right. I probably do have speed. I probably could have been click Thunder Punch. Ah! Uh. Scizor comes out. Thorns doesn't? Oh, okay. Well, shoot. I guess I gotta get feed in, huh? Um, maybe he clicks bullet punch here on kill. I kind of wish I could see what he does. If I could make a bug type move, that'd be insane. And then pyro it. I mean, I'm gonna outspeed anyway. I actually think hard swap feed is pretty fair. But he has rocks up. But he'll never click a bug type move. Yeah, I think I gotta believe in feet. I do not think bullet kills me. Does it does it kill in rain pyro ball? If he has fire type berry, I don't, and then that's just GG. Feet deserves to die at that point. I do not have another play here though. I'm assuming he does not have a fire berry because it's meant to be run in rain. Come on, man. I lived. I'll take it. <laughs> I'll take it. I mean, I just have speed and click U-turn now. Never punished. Never ever punished. Okay, um... Always water type move, right? Flippers? No, he could see hurricane kill. Don't risk that. Um... I mean, he is still toxic. I think just send in booty cheeks. At worst, he clicks Hurricane, but Booty Cheeks is fine. He did click Scald, though. Alright, um, I wonder if we outspeed. I, f I figure I would live Hurricane. Let's just Ice Punch it. Tough Claws boosted. No, Crunch it. Yeah, that's more damage. All right, our citrus berry is gone. Very important. So knockoff is not doing extra damage. I don't think he'll be able to Oko me here. I think I just go for the kill on Hydro Fangs. We have speed. I'll take it. Ah. 
Wow. I feel like we're playing pretty well. Hold on. We didn't even use Genesect. Hurricane. I uh, don't think Hurricane does anything for me here. Very clean so far. Very clean, very clean. God damn it, not another double battle. No. I kind of like Tails outspeed flip turn. Um, so hear me out, right? Hmm. I kind of like feet. As long as Tails outspeeds feet, which it doesn't, Fodge, never mind. Alright, skeleton U turn. So that way we could get. Floats will back in to flip turn again. I kind of like feet. I really want to teach Volt Switch back to Tommy, man. I'm going to do it. As crazy as it seems. Uh, I'm gonna run a brick break. I think I want to keep like switching things out, so I kind of like this. Kind of tempted to get rid of feet on this battle in particular. So I tell you what we'll do. Um, I'll bring freaking Shuckle Luckle for the hell of it, just to slow pivot out. I don't really know what Shuckle's gonna do here, but at worst he dies, and I don't care. Struggle Bug could actually be really good in doubles. Just lower their attack stats, yeah. Uh, what's up, dog? New haircut stream? Mainless is the first one to notice. Thank you, Mainless. I appreciate it. Rock slide. I mean, it does do both, but like, I'm not gonna outspeed anything. Could do sturdy custap. What on shuckle? Probably do run sturdy though, to be fair. Um, I'll run Lumberry, why not? Like screens or anything? I don't think so. Some form of support. I mean, protect would be good if it just had leftovers. Bro, so many times, man, I just need leftovers. Okay, bulldoze is good. That's good. But I... God, I need so many of these moves, though. I mean, bulldoze is really good in combination with, um... Thorns. We could even web. More Persona 3. I mean, at the point... Now where the combat is starting to get more strategic and engaging. So really early though, only 25 hours. Hey, that's great though. I'm glad you're enjoying the game. Uh, game made me hella emotional. I love that game. I'm so excited for the DLC. I'm gonna stream all of it again. You already can know. You know, stream Persona 3 Reload for a week straight. Granted, the DLC is gonna be a lot smaller. You only need Siegfried. True. Or Vanna D's nuts in your mouth. But that's a DLC. Where's my Shuckle evolution, bro? Bro, I hate Shuckle. I think I do run sturdy. Alright, alright.
At least in a double battle, I don't think Toxic is that good. I don't think Sticky Web is good either, to be fair. But whatever. I'll chill. Alright, let's just try it. What's the worst that could happen? Besides losing the entire run. Are these gonna be Mega Evolutions? Because the last double battle before, I had two Mega Evolutions. That's all I'm saying. Alright, just flip turn out. It'll be fine. Wait. Does Lantern get Storm Drain or Water Absorb? It's Water Absorb, right? I think it's Water Absorb, so I should be fine. I don't think it draws in moves. Y'all shouldn't be able to kill me. Loki attempted to just stay in and Giga Drain, but yeah, it's Water Absorb. No Megas for these mons? Okay, good. Honestly, I might just go for the double attack on Stunfist. I do not... I sincerely doubt that anything can kill Skeleton here. As scared as I am. Water compaction? No. No! This is just knowledge gap, man. This is just the knowledge gap, man. <laughs> so they buffed water compaction. Not only did they give Stunfist water compaction, but they made it so that water compaction makes you immune to water and gives you defense buffs. Bro, wait. Do I lose? I think I need a struggle bug. He's just gonna surf my ass. Wait. Do I lose? I need the struggle bug. But I don't think I'm gonna be able to get it off. Because Shuggah's gonna get out sped and killed. But I do definitely need a struggle bug. Uh, I'm scared about Discharge on Flippers, but I don't really have a choice. Not really. I guess I could sack Booty Cheeks. But I think I'd rather just send in Flippers. Are you serious? I think I lose. Okay. I might be able to outspeed. But he has defense up the freaking ass. I'm trying to think of an out here. Okay, I have a Pasho Berry. Very insane. I have a Pasho Berry. Keep that in mind. I should outspeed and I could rock slide flinch. Okay, let me put it this way. AI probably sees that I'm water absorbed. It sees that flipper is water absorbed. So they might even go for double discharge. If I switch flippers out, then it's fine. And even if they do surf, Tommy's got a Pasho Berry. I think- Ah, uh, no, he's got plus six defense, bro. What do I do? Get a crit. Easy. I guess I can protect to see what they're gonna do. I don't really know if that's smart, though. I think I- Ah... Uh, I think just Ice Beam. Yeah. Nice. Come on. Yes! Yes! Okay. So Surf is going to kill Tummy, and that's why he's gonna go for it. Switch out Tummy into Booty Cheeks. 
I don't think he clicks discharge because he doesn't see kill on flippers. But he sees surf kill on tummy, so he's going to automatically go for that. Toxic it. Nice! Oh my god, we did it. Okay. It, uh... Uh... I have not- I have yet to see Discharge from this thing. I don't even know if he has it. Or if he's choice. Like, what if he's choice specs? Because if I send in Tummy right now and he clicks Surf, because he's locked in for some reason. Um... A sec anyway, yeah. No, you're right. Just don't risk it. Just do damage. Honestly, I could probably live a discharge. I feel like I could like maybe the whittle actually be more more helpful here. He's trapped. Oh my god. Okay, losing Tails really sucks, because I actually was growing attached to him. But I'm completely okay with losing Shuckle, I'll be honest. <laughs> that was insane! Hey, I'm shocked I made it through that, I'm gonna be honest. That card was insane. And yeah, I romanced those three. Mainless. Usually I try to only romance one girl, but uh, I really wanted to see a lot of the new events and stuff. Fossil was only doing that much damage in rain. Okay, he still would have done good damage, though. You gotta understand, he did so much because they were- and they were resisted. Usually he would Oko people with that turn move. Imagine Choice Band Flip Turn Technician Floatzel. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm pretty upset that I couldn't keep Floatzel. <laughs> These freaking. <laughs> Whatever, man. All right, I'm okay with losing Shuckle. That's fine. No, we gotta go into the second box for dead mods. Oh my god. Well, now that freaking Floatzel's dead, we may as well bring Pinsir back. I mean, Pinsir, Beedrill back. My assumption is that we're ending with a double battle of Mega Evolution proportions. Or someone with a Mega Evolution, at least. Hey, I gotta say, though. Water Absorb... Lapras was definitely the play. I would not have been able to survive that without Water Absorb. Shout out to Rentoid for uh, making me do that. Raichu comes out. This is fine. Uh, because... Beedrill Spadef is not that bad. Um... I'm wondering if I just stay in and click Poison Jab. I guess you could be physical, though, is my issue. You know what? I'm gonna believe in Stinger. I don't believe- No! I didn't mean to- Okay, I killed. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that, but I'll take it. gets burned. I did not get burned. Okay, um... God, I did a lot of damage considering it was freaking quad resist. Uh, may as well booty cheeks here. Flamethrower, we're good. Ooh, it's Life Orb Macargo. Okay. Ludicolo, it's Gamath. Um... He clicks a grass type move. Honestly, hard swap stinger? I don't think he ever clicks water type move. Screw it. Quad resist. This is like the only time I'll be able to send it in. Spadef is not bad at all. Fake out. That's fine. Uh, Jab. It's Swift Swim. We still have Sped. 
I probably would have lived. Eh, I don't know. I think I would have lived the scald. Whatever. This is Swift Swim Bear Tick for sure. I'm gonna switch this thing out. I don't know. I am max speed, right? I might even outspeed Swift Swim Bear Tick. Oh god, no, it wasn't. I was so scared. Oh, it might have been Rain Dish Ludicolo. That's a set too, like bulky Rain Dish. Lorb Cargo. Yeah. See, me, me and Rento, I think of the same thing. Stop reading my mind. <laughs> uh, I might be being a little too paranoid. But I really don't want to lose Stinger, man. I want to U-turn so bad. Realistically, I could probably just use Tummy. God damn! That did some damage! I'm worried about fighting type move. CC. Let's just see what he does. He's gotta be Swift Swim, man. I think I should have just clicked U-turn. But what if he outsped Stinger? He has Aqua Jet, probably. Yeah, he might. What if he goes for it here? Pick your sack, I guess. That is Booty Cheeks, to be fair. That was the purpose of Booty Cheeks since day one, was to sack it. But hear me out, though. What if he goes for Icicle Crash? Then Flipper's just... No, he's gonna click CC. He could click CC, at least. I did not change Gator's nature, no. But I don't think it would have mattered either way. Okay, what if he's not Swift Swim? He's totally Swift Swim. Who am I kidding? Um. And then I guess after this, I'm switching in feet. Yeah, I mean, I need to sack. I really don't have an option. Uh, I don't have a Pryo move anymore. One more CC drive you ever to kill with Quick Attack. I didn't even think about Quick Attack. I do have a Pryo move. Yeah, I guess just do it, right? I think I could kill from here. He took a lot of Lord damage. like I can kill, right? Am I crazy? Nice. Did they change his typing? What, bear tick? Maybe he's fighting. I know some realm hacks that change it to fighting. All right, sorry, booty cheeks. You were the weakest link. We are just killing things off to make it through, man. This is so bad. I mean, what's our next sack? I still don't know how to evolve this thing. It really wouldn't be a bad encounter if I could just evolve it. Rampardos. This is the definition of a sack. When am I ever going to be able to use this thing? I guess if I had a choice scarf, it'd be like, okay. Maybe he gets like some insane moves. Does he get a cell rock? I could see a cell rock. Hold on. Drinking game out of this stream. True. I've lost so many mods. I really don't even know, like, 
They could have given this thing like sturdy or something. I don't know. Something. A higher speed stat. RL end in game. I think you literally need a scarf with this thing. I think, honestly, I'll sack Cranium if need be. Oh. My. God. I see land. Oh my god. Oh my god. I was lost at sea for years. Ah. New encounter. Alright, let's immediately change this back to uh, adaptability. And give it back its uh, other things. Water Absorb was really good though, I will say. But I think now it'll be a little bit too niche for it to be better. But it was really good. And I would even go as far to say that it carried us in that one fight. Um, let's see. Hydro Pump. Overprotect. Kind of like Water Absorb. You have a lot of moves, mons that bait water moves. I like it too, but like, I just don't think overall it's going to be as useful. Like, yeah, maybe we'll fight one Mon per team that has water moves, but like, the only reason why we saw so much use out of it in that route was because it was a rain route. Like, I think most of the time we'll be fine even still pivoting into a resist, right? What is the most common type to be fair? I mean, yeah. I don't know. I see the argument for Water Absorb, though. I really do. But I believe in Adaptability. Especially because, yeah, Adaptability Ice Shard is the other huge thing. That crap is insane. With a mixed uh, attack stat, like, oh my god. That's so much damage. You know what I'll argue though? I don't know if Shell Bell is actually that good. I might just do the Citrus. Focus Ash should also uh, be really good on Cranium. Okay. First encounter, man. Let's get it. I don't have a Yawn Mon anymore, by the way. It'll be fine. Runs into a legendary. Are there no encounters here? I'm gonna cry. No, there are. Did I? Hello? Okay. Connor, I better be so buffed in this game. I want this thing to be insane. I want this thing to be absolutely busted. I didn't mean to damage him. Okay, well this is teeth. Levitate, which is fine. Called Meadow Rush. And it has a very minorly buffed stats. Meadow Rush. What does Meadow Rush do? Double speeding grass terrain. I guess that's fair. I don't have a way to set up grass terrain, though. Yeah, I think it got an attack buff, maybe. I don't know. It's still so meh. It's still so meh. God damn it, this thing sucks ass. The knock is wrong. What? Or outdated.
What are are its base stats in the dock better than it, what it says here? I would have liked this a lot better if it just got um the grass terrain like ability that sets it up. Power whip. These aren't the stats on the dock. They're still bad on there though too. <laughs> I mean, hey, I found the new sack at least. <laughs> this thing sucks. Let's go, new sack just dropped. Yes, sir. Maybe he gets. Flip turn, who knows? He gets defog, hold on. I'll run speed lowering nature, run mixed from sack to sack. Um, we'll run speed lower and attack raising. Hey, look, we got the setup going crazy. May as well run Levitate. He's so slow. Do you get any more encounters or do you need to be Chuck first? I really hope I get more encounters, otherwise I'm screwed. Maybe Shuckle is uh, randomized. Secret Potion, go quietly. Please. What? Ain't no way! New Team Rocket event just dropped. Hot damn. Dazzling Gleam. Is there no Shuckle encounter here? There's gotta be, right? That's like a, that's a classic. They don't have the Shuckle gift encounter? What? Person snatched you. That's tough. That's super tough. What the hell? I don't feel like giving anything to Carnivine. You know what I'm going to give him? I'm going to give him the, uh... The, uh, Pryo one. Because who knows? Maybe it could be the, the win con. What is it? Custap? There you go. Gonna get that Pryo Power Whip. You seen? <gasps> what did I say earlier, chat? No way! Freeze dry? Wait, 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 wait. T check moves. Yes, sir! Oh, yo, Sparkling Iris kind of goaded too. Hold on. Does Sparkling Iris hurt, hurt everyone or just the two opponents? If it's just the two opponents, this is an easy take. Freeze Dry is a must take, though, for sure. I mean, I'll go to Hydro Pump for now. Eh, yeah, could use it with Throat Spray, but I don't have Throat Spray. Fudge. I may as well teach Sparkling Aria over Surf. There's no reason not to. They're the same base power. Ice Beam's quite a bit stronger, though. I really don't want to get rid of it. Ice Shard is too good. Especially with its mixed nature. I guess I got rid of Pump. It, I mean, hell, if Sparkling Aria only hits the opponents and not your partner, I'm okay with not needing Hydro Pump. Yeah, I'm cool with this set. The sleep powder. Okay. 
This is actually really useful. I'm not even gonna cap. I'm sacking it for sure. But, hey. That's a win con right there. The rage powder. That's gas. <laughs> Granted, he's not bulky, so... It's not really gonna be that useful. Yeah, it should have made this thing, like, really bulky. God, he's so frail for no reason. Like, what the fudge? The perfect cycle. That is true. At that point, I might as well give him a citrus. And, nah. I still like the the idea of Custap Berry carrying. Bro, everything has changed. Oh yeah, that's right, you don't get any. How do you get Drill Run? Teach Egg moves, well of course you can't. Damn, I ain't got no Egg moves. Hey, I jump kick, I was waiting on this. I would unironically do Wide Lens instead of Flying Gem. Cause realistically, right, with Wide Lens, you get so much out of Pyro Ball and High Jump Kick. I know that Quick Attack was kind of goaded there, but realistically... Oh, su oh my god, Sucker Punch? Oh my god, what am I talking about? Definitely run Sucker Punch. Well, yeah, then get rid of Quick Attack for that, easily. Alright, well now, how the heck do I justify High Jump Kick? I don't know if I can. But it's so strong. Obviously, we need U-Turn. Obviously, we need Sucker Punch. Flying Gem Acrobatics is really strong, but if we get rid of Acrobatics, that means we could give it a different uh, item. That's Pyro Ball hit more. Yeah, that's kind of what I meant. Like Pyro Ball and High Jump Kick combo with Wide Lens is actually really good. But on the flip side, Flying Gem Acrobatics is so absurdly strong. Like that's a nuke. That's like a Z move. I don't know. But fighting stab? It's really tough, man. Hmm. God, his moveset's already so perfect. I'm not going to teach how to jump kick. It's weak to protect, too. Like, I don't want to risk it. And it means I have to run wide lens. Run moves depending on what... Yeah, that's true. Depending on what I'm fighting, yeah. Oh, acrobatics for this gym. Definitely. Do I have any uh, mons that completely get changed with egg moves not really i doubt you get anything insane how do i evolve pause i need this like right now somebody find out this is so important do you get anything good by egg move rampardo says cell rock egg move incoming oh yo no that would be insane iron head iron tail Not quite. I guess friendship? That's my assumption, but I don't even know if there are friendship evolutions in this game. Crunch, sheer force boosted. Iron head, sheer force boosted. Hammer arm just cuz. I didn't say jack. Wait, this Pokemon can't evolve. I assume it just means that... How do I get the evolution? Yeah, it's definitely not fully evolved.
Fake out's good though. Hold on. Fake out and wish. We got a wish pass here, boys. Kind of a weird one, but... Did they name it wrong? No, because his base stats are um, still ass. I know this thing's like ridiculously fast. Like this is not its stats. It's not that bad. But yeah, Rage Powder will definitely help in doubles. Oh, wait, I didn't even check freaking Garbodor. Haze is pretty good. Oh, Tautomaz. Yeah, I mean... I guess I could see Curse setup, maybe. I don't know. It's kind of odd. I might actually bring Garbodor for uh, fighting. You need to stop this mind reading. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because you said what egg versus Garb get. Clearly, we're just both big brain. All right, we know what to do. All right. Any other encounters that we can get? Kinglerite. Hey, yo, where my Kingler at? Sorry, but you need Chuck's badge before you can be granted passage. What the fudge? Why is there just a sign with nothing on it? I'm expecting big things from Russell Link. Agreed. We're gonna we're gonna be coming up with so many unique strats. All right. <laughs> Gotta battle this hoe now. I guess I'll just stick with Stinger. Keep running up. I'm so cool with Pasho Berry overall, but like, just give him the Citrus. It'll likely come in clutch more. Ak is definitely fair on uh, Genesect. Whatever. You're the one who released the Legendary Beast. Ever since then, I've been on a hunt for Suicune. Battle me. Got a job to do. Uh, I don't think Felstinger will one-shot it. I'm just gonna go for X-Scissor. Nice. Good lead. Gengar comes out. I'm screwed. You turn out. No way! I should have speed, right? Yeah, we're good. Um, okay, he's gonna have Shadow Tag. Keep that in mind. Um, what is he gonna click? Whatever he clicks is gonna hit like a freaking truck. <laughs> Sack teeth? <laughs> uh, I mean, Sucker Punch will kill. I'm just worried I won't, like, will I just get one shot if I send in feet right now? Bye, Carnivine. <laughs> I don't want to just sag just to sag. What if feet can live? Because Sucker Punch will kill from this range. It just will. And who knows, maybe he clicked Nasty Plot. I believe in feet. Maybe I shouldn't. Why do the crits? Why do the crits happen? So okay, you're right though. I it was too late to warn you. You you were right though. I shouldn't have um done that because of psychic terrain. But that is that wow, wow, wow that crit man. Who knows? I could have outsped. Maybe it wasn't max speed. Fudge! I just got sucker punch. Come on, man.
Spectral Shriek. I guess. I mean, this is valid. I mean, I can assume that Skeleton lives a non-crit. I really wish that didn't crit. At least if he did die, I would know that Skeleton could live. But now I just don't know. I mean, at least he can't click a poison type move, I guess. I mean, Skeleton would be able to kill. I guess I just gotta do it. Okay. Fudge. Electro comes out. Uh, he already used his Mega. Um, I guess just an in Tummy. Tummy's pretty free here. So his teeth. Each time I go away from PC, Mons die. It's so sad. Boom burst. Get the frick out of here! Can you kill me? If Tummy dies here, I don't even know what I'm gonna say. <laughs> Tommy! Runs dead. Runs dead. Man, man. Well, I've learned in this moment that this game, I've learned in this moment that this game cannot be played blind. <laughs> Come on, man. It's Radical Red at the end of the day. It's Johto Radical Red. I don't know what I expected. I'm so bummed. Chilling cry? <laughs> Come on, man. Like, case in point, how am I supposed to know he has that? He has hidden power grass, chilling cry, boom burst, and probably an electric type move. Nice coverage, bro. I should be able to live. Oh, I outsped. Oh, never mind. He just kills me. Well, that's great. <laughs> I'm really about to lose to you, scene. I mean, I don't have a win condition. I've lost. Unless by some miracle, Flippers lives. But oh wait, I shard. That's right. Oh, never mind. Second terrain. <laughs> I couldn't have even stalled terrain. For some reason, it's still up. He must have a terrain extender. Because I would have died this turn, even if I did sack skeleton first. GG. Of all things to end the run, it was freaking you seen. I will say, Genesect was not as much of a run carry as I thought it would be. Genesect was honestly kind of eh. The real run carry was Tummy. Let's be real. Tummy deserves his spot on the later manor wall of fame. Shoutouts Earth Eater Tummy, bro. Earth Eater Tummy and Shell Armor Galissapod. These are the two winners. Who else were winners? Everything else is just okay. <laughs> I love this thing too, Foreskin for Metasoid. 
We gotta tell me way too early for how OP it is. That's true. Meginium, my short-lived goat. He was a goat for uh, as short-lived as it was. This game is great, man. I'm gonna come back to this game at some point. The problem is that, you know, like, the content creator in me and the Nuzlocker in me are kind of at odds with each other because I do love reading docs and, you know, using docs in order to get through hard fights, but I know for a lot of people, most people, it's not entertaining to watch runs like that. Um, that I'm, you know, reading up on trainer teams and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, it's a bummer, really. Um, Fudge, man. For me, this one would be a mixed point. It's kind of hard, because, like, clearly the game is taking a Radical Red approach at this point in the game. I mean, the whole game, really, because it's the same thing, right? Like, the early game is not that hard in Rad Red. Feels too easy with Docs, I think. I don't think so. Granted, you gotta remember, Silence, I'm playing Rando mode. Imagine without the Randomizer. This game would be a lot harder without the Randomizer. You know what I could do on a on a replay through? Hmm. I mean, hell, you gotta remember, this thing was hard carrying the entire playthrough. I would have been lost so long ago if I did not get this. I didn't remember the rando, yeah. Like, there were a lot of really good mods that we got because of the rando, you know, Scizor. I mean, lots of really good encounters here, right? I thought it was placed too early. Makes sense now. Oh, yeah. You kidding me? No, I got Iron Thorns, like, right before Falconer, even. <laughs> kind of insane. The moment I saw Earth Eater, I was like, what? What? That's a really cool buff, by the way. A little too OP, I think. I think they probably would have been better giving it, like, Galvanize or something. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if Earth Eater makes that much sense for this thing, bro. <laughs> it's just too good. Do you think this thing would be Ubers? With Earth Eater. I don't know. Its stats are not that great. But I don't know. Ground immunity. He has like... It's not that good. It's pretty good, man. I don't know. He's only weak to water and... Uh, and grass. And fighting, I guess. Oh, you maybe. He'd definitely be at least OU. You. you kidding me? Ground healing. Not even ground immunity. He heals from ground. Like, Orthworm is too niche to, for you to understand how good that ability is, right? You heal from earthquakes. That's insane. And it gets Volt Switch. Slow Volt Switcher. I feel like Assault Vest slow Volt Switch with Earth Eater. Oh my god. Come on, man. Ah, uh, I'm so bummed. Kong got really weak overall, though. You think so? God, and Floatzel was really good, too. Kermit, I wouldn't rank it that high. Really? We could randomize Volt Switch. Volt Wave. Oh, speaking of Rentoid, I know you saw earlier, you said earlier that, um, they used to stream. Uh, would you actually be interested in streaming the Soul Link? I, I mean, granted. Uh, I don't know if you're comfortable with that, but if we could both stream it, then, um, then I think it's fine. If, if you're interested in that, or we could just do it on our own time, I don't mind either way. But I just know that you mentioned in passing that you used to stream, uh, Nuzlocke, so. Could be a fun little, uh, co-stream type of thing. But I'm also down to just do it on off time as well. Doesn't matter either way. I'm down, why not? Yee. That could be fire. My only thing as a, as for streaming Soul Links though, is uh, back before Dolphin and uh, and my other friends that I used to Soul Link with, um, I always said like, it's hard because I, I it's hard for me to find time, right? Um, outside of stream time. So that'd be good then. Maybe whenever we decide to do it. Um, we could do, 
I guess the problem with Vault White, though, is that... Eh, maybe it wouldn't be that bad. Since we're hardcore soul linking. Yeah, it's not like we're racing, never mind. I have to get a new PC so bad. My uh, computer is not good. Um, it would still definitely run the game perfectly fine. I just wouldn't be able to speed up very good. You do like two days a week on stream or something. Hey, if you're down, I'm down. Hardcore Soul Link Volt White. I think that'd be a good idea. I have to decide what I'm going to do next. I think I'm going to take a break from this game, unless y'all want to see more of this. I could try again. I think I'd have to alter it, though. If I really am going to try to play this game blind... Again, man, I got so hard carried by thorns. I don't know if I could have even, like, beaten three gyms without thorns. I mean, what could I really do, right? I could, uh... I could maybe encounter route. I'm seeing an emerald release as soon as well. I could try that. That's all double battles, right? God, I gotta turn on the AC. Hold on. I'll see. No freaking wonder the heater was on. Uh, I was planning to play that one. Um, I could check it out really quick. Hold on. Obsidian Emerald, man. Kind of like feet. <laughs> Rentoid, if you uh, have a clip um, of t of uh, one of my stream moments, then uh, post them in the Eclipse channel in my channel Discord. That way everybody can see them. Let's see. What am I doing again? Pokemon stuff. Yeah, Abby posted this earlier. Is there like a like a website for it? I, I just want to be able to look at the stuff without looking at the trailer. I mean, I already looked at the trailer, but like... Hold on. Oh, okay, so it says the features in the YouTube video. Monster Gen 8. And you start from first eight generations, modern abilities, moves, typing, mega evolution. Yeah, it's hard. Um, it's very, very hard. Because I think I get the most hype moments playing blind. Like, when I used to run Run and Bun, I noticed, like, a lot of people weren't as interested in it because, like, you know, it's, it's a lot of calcing, it's a lot of, um, research. I mean, that game, again, that's an example of a game that needs to be calced. To be fair, I think I could beat... Okay, I'll put it this way with Grueling Gold. I could beat this game with just docs. And I've also beaten Radical Red with just docs, like, without a calculator. I don't think these games need a calculator. I'll say that. But I do think... You kind of need to know what each opponent has. Like, with how the heck was I supposed to know Electrode was going to have Boom Burst Throat Spray with chill, with the Ice and Grass type moves? Like, bro, what? Uh, you just need experience and prep. Yeah, like I think I think um, I could definitely beat this game looking at the teams. But I don't think I need calcs at all. Like, I have pretty decent mental calcs. Um. Hmm. I don't know. Because the thing is, I, I actually do like this game, though. I will say. I mean, and y'all you, you know me. I, I hate Pokemon fan games. Um, but this one was good. You know? Uh, I think it had a good mix. Um, I like a lot of the buffs. Again, they're very Radical Red inspired. Um, but, I mean, Earth Eater <laughs> does. I mean, whatever the heck it's called. The randomizer was a fun way to experience a lot of the buffs. I honestly wouldn't be against doing rando again. Even though I don't like randos, but I mean, obviously, 
I like doing randos where the trainers aren't random for the most part, and it also makes it more interesting as a viewer, I think. Hmm. Hmm. I can do next fight without docs. Oh, played some run and bun yesterday. Got wrecked because I thought I could do next uh, fight without docs. Damn, the throw. No, run and bun, you need docs and calcs like the whole way through. I mean, you could beat the trainers without docs for sure, but the gym leaders is another story. I think the gym leaders, you basically need calcs. Um, get the randomizer similar strength working on ball weight. You got it to work? No way. Wait, how'd you do that? I used to try randomizing Drano games all the time. Maybe it's just because I tried to randomize trainer teams? Is that what messed it up? Like, the wild encounters actually still work? Seriously? I actually didn't think that they would. I mean, if we could do similar strength... Yeah, that'll be why. Damn, if we could do similar strength, that's, that's gonna make that run really fun, I think. First run is still gym six. I doubt I reach that anytime soon, lol. I could definitely, man. I have what it takes to beat running, but I know I do, but like I would want to A, I would need to stream it, because again, with Nuzlocks, I can only stream them at this point. I hate doing Nuzlocks on my own. Because I'm too tempted to cheat. And uh you know, there's the pride of nuzlocking, right? Like, I like being able to show off that I did something uh, to even a smaller audience, you know? Um, it makes it way more fun for me. Uh, gonna test the end first fight just to make sure. Yeah, it's a good idea. Yeah, check out the encounter, see if there's similar strength in uh, everything. 100% works. Hey, that's awesome. We can get in a call, like, um, at some point, um, and check it out. But yeah, you're down for dual stream, or would you prefer to just do it on our own? I don't know how often you stream, like, I don't know if, um, because I haven't checked out any of your streams or anything. We could set starters to have two Evos minimum. Keep power level similar. Yeah, that's a good idea. I like that. Bum ba -da bum ba dum ba ba dum ba dum bum. Oh, I'm actually excited and doing the typing rule and everything. Happy to dual stream it. I'm not streaming a while, but that's mainly because I've had nothing to stream. Tbh. Well, hey, there you go. That gives you something. Yeller. The only reason why I uh, I think I would prefer to stream is just because um, str my stream time is mostly when uh when I'm free. You know, um, and outside of that, like for nighttime, uh, I mean, I could, uh, but Andrea, my girlfriend, she, uh, <laughs> you know, she, she doesn't like it when I play at night. And honestly, I, I understand, you know, I already streamed the whole morning anyway. That gives me more time though. And it gives us more time to play. So that's good. I think that'll be fun. Um... Hell, do you think that we could even do that Thursday? I don't think I have anything else planned for Pokemon games, is the thing. <laughs> My man's really put, I kind of like feet. It would definitely take calcs and stuff. Schedules line up quite nicely because of time zones and stuff. So we could write it out on a call sometime. Nice. Alright. Good to know. Like, you could. Do you think that you'd be able to do, like, Mondays or Thursdays at, like, 12? Cause I, honestly, it does kind of work out since I just lost this run. And I didn't really know what else I was going to play. I didn't really know what Pokemon game to play. But again, like Silence said, I could have tried the Subsidian Emerald. 
the thing is that I have the whole, I have this whole like emerald uh, event planned for the, for, um, for the summer. And that's like a big thing for my community. God, Volt? Plays like Volt White Hardcore Soul Link sounds insane. Uh, I could do Mondays, but I'm not able to do Wednesdays. Um, because that's my Variety Wednesday day. I can do Mondays. I mean, we can do we can make it a weekly thing. I'm down for that. Although, you know what? Before I get too excited, I have to make sure... Um, here, I'm going to DM you something, Rentoid. Don't say what, though. Don't say what I DM. Okay, sweet. <laughs> sweet. Just confirming, just confirming. Just confirming. Alright, then yeah, that'd be fun. Uh and for weekly stream, why not? Alright, let's do that then. Uh, I still have to find out something to do on Thursday then. Hmm. I guess I could try this uh this Obsidian Emerald. Silence, did you say this comes out? Like, what day did you say this came out? I think you said it at some point. Obsidian Emerald releases soon. You said soon. Fourteenth? Is that literally on Thursday? Am I tripping? Well, that feels meant to be, doesn't it? <laughs> I guess it would have to release in the morning, though, which, to be fair, it could be released at night. I, I can't do that, Rantoid. I, I do appreciate that you're excited for it, but I can't do it. That's, like, my whole thing. I've done Variety Wednesdays for, like, um, for, like, I don't know, at least six months now. I've been on for a while. Um, that's, like, part of my thing. Um, I would even be okay with doing Tuesdays, but obviously, yeah, you, you have stuff to do on Tuesdays, so no worries there. Again, I'm cool with just once a week. That's fine. It gives me uh, a chance to do something on my own anyway. Stepping your toes here on the stream. Yeah, I appreciate that. Yeah, it could be fun, though. It'll be a fun little weekly thing to do. I think it's a good idea, actually. I gotta find something single player to do then. Um, fudge, man. Damn, I can't believe I lost. I don't know, Grueling Gold, man, great game. I think I, ah, it's a bummer, but I think I would need to look at the teams. Which, to be fair, I could. I think the way I see it, Silence, let me, Silence and Runtoy, both of you, what do you think would be better? Would it be better, um, uh, if I was to ever come back to this game, would it be better for me to, like, do the rando again, but would encounter routing be enough? We could. I got so lucky, though, with thorns, man. I got so lucky. Because I could use the, the, the decks and, like, change... Uh, I could change it to night and stuff like that to like kind of influence different encounters hmm. 
I could also choose the encounters, but that just doesn't make it as exciting. Fudge. Fudge. I literally just got egg moves too, man. Do you think that... Dude, do you think that they upped the difficulty a lot because of this guy? It's possible. I mean, that freaking Electrode had a, a move of every type. He had 18 move types. <laughs> Could get lucky again, TBH. I do like this game. But if Obsidian Emerald really releases, I'd be willing to try it. Whatever, either way, I had fun. Thank you for watching. Uh, I'm gonna get about. I will see y'all uh, probably not tomorrow, unfortunately. Again, I just have too much work to do. I don't know if um, I'm gonna be able to stream four days a week for a while now. Tuesday, I'm kind of using as my work day, basically. That's what I've been doing, but yeah. Uh. It doesn't run away. If you don't like Obsidian, just go back to this. That's true. The thing is that I'm sure I'll like Obsidian. But this is a challenge hack, right? So I, I would need to look at docs for this now. I'm sure that this is hard. This is like another run and bun type deal, right? It's just all doubles. Probably no way I could beat this blind, do you think? I guess it's not confirmed whether or not this is like run and bun difficulty. Maybe it's just like chill. Double screams for a lot of sex. I mean, again, I can try it. But I just get the feeling that, uh... I get the feeling it's gonna be run and bun like difficulty. But I might try it. Just get Inso or Rilla and you're fine. True, that's all you need. Just get those. To be fair, yeah, you could probably choose either one of those, right? And at that point, you may as well. Should I choose Insin or Rilla? Probably Insin, to be fair. Doubt it's run and bun difficulty, but it doesn't need to be. No, because it's all doubles. I mean, doubles by itself is unique and charging by itself. <sighs> doubles harsh by itself, right. <laughs> I mean, who knows? If it's like Dreano difficulty, then I can probably do it, even blind. All right, whatever. Doubles were like uh, the main killers in this run too. Yeah, well, I think the main problem in Grueling Gold is that like I ended up getting not very many good synergies with each other. Like so many of my mons are specifically good for singles like Mega Beedrill, Cinderace, uh, Meowskarada. Um, hell, even Genesect. I feel like Genesect is not very good for doubles, in general. Um, God, Genesect really didn't do much, did it? I don't know, man. Ah, this game was fun, though. Maybe I will give it another shot on a Thursday. Or I'll play Obsidian Emerald. I don't know, I'll see. If Obsidian Emerald releases in the night, then I'll play this. If not, then whatever. Yada yada. I'm still bummed that Dugon couldn't learn flip turn, bro, with the full hodge. I guess that's the other thing about this game, too, is that this game is constantly being updated. Um, so, I don't know. Update available. Oh. Nice. <laughs> NC is probably the better choice, especially since fire is more rare and intent parting is so hard to beat. Yeah. Maybe I'll just do that. Maybe I'll just min-max and just click intent. 
I assume that you can get your hidden ability, like, right off the bat. Even just, like, Intim, uh... Cat. What, <laughs> what is the first form of Ensign? I was about to say Lit Leo. Uh, Torah Cat's the middle. Litten. It's Litten. It's Litten. It is Litten. I, I, look, I said it before you said it, alright? You gotta believe. Vision goes in Rad Red as well. That's true. Cutting some slack. Genesect existed for like half a round. <laughs> the Devil on SSN or before Geo. Yeah, very true. Very, 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 very true. Yeah, on, honestly, and again, I, I'll say it again. Um, it's hard to find, like, that good balance of, like, uh, like, a difficult game that I can play blind. So that way it's not just me looking at docs the entire time. That's the thing, though, with me and Rentoid Soul Link. Let's be real. We're probably going to need to use calcs. <laughs> Bro, hardcore soul link of Blaze Black Vault White is insane. And it's meant to be insane. But like using the typing rule, bro. 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 It's so absurd. And now that we have the similar power um encounters like we can't even get like some crazy legendaries or anything to solo. Like, it's all going to be, like... We're not going to be able to find a single Legendary in the entire game. Honestly, I wonder if it's even possible. We're going to need Calcs and Docs, which, to be fair, if we're together, I think it'll still make the stream a lot more fun. Right? Theoretically. Assuming we mesh well together, but I feel like we will. We're both freaking nerds, clearly. Whatever. I'll finally leave. Y'all have a great night. Later, manners.